Imagine a world where it is possible to peer into the mysteries of the human brain, a world where we understand and cure neurological conditions like Parkinson's, epilepsy, or schizophrenia. With its billions of interconnected neurons, the brain is the most extraordinary organ in the human body. The host of emotions, our reflections, our senses and movements, it is the guardian of our central nervous system. Yet, we still don't really know how it works. The team of Professor Tiron is developing computer programs capable of mapping our neural networks without removing tissue or operational procedures. We are interested in an analysis of cerebral connectivity by magnetic resonance imaging, which allows us to perform a cartography of the connections between the different regions of the brain. This work has applications in the domain of fundamental neuroscience, for the better understanding of the connectivity in the brain in general, but also in clinical situations such as, for example, neurosurgery for the treatment of conditions such as Parkinson's disease. There is a double goal, to understand illness better and the damage implied in neurodegeneration but also to detect as early as possible the first signs of these illnesses in order to treat them more effectively. This is exactly what we can achieve with our techniques. Looking at the results of our treatment, we can see the relevant zone, the zone of the thalamus, and we can visualize the fibers coming out of it. And if we look, for example, at the dose that a particular zone is going to receive, we can see each bundle of fibers and the dose that they are getting. This is the University Hospital in Lausanne, where clinical director Professor Le Vivier is working with Professor Tiron in the study of Parkinson's disease. So, treatment by gamma knife is one of the alternatives to traditional practices in neurosurgery, and it allows, amongst other things, to treat some forms of shaking, like the shaking of Parkinson's, which we call essential tremor. It has the great advantage of being a totally non-invasive technique, which means that it does not involve drilling. There is no need to enter the cranium nor the brain because the imaging techniques being developed in this laboratory allow us to have a very high precision with regard to the deep anatomical structure of the brain as well as the fibers around it, pinpointing the target we want to treat with the gamma knife. This is just the beginning. The ability to map neural fibers without removing samples increases the possibilities of research on the brain. It should allow us to lift the veil on the mysteries surrounding this fascinating organ.